Yo, what's up, folks, man? It's your motherfucking boy, 313 Hitman, and I'm coming back one more again with another video from Hitman's Misogyny Part 2. This time, I'm going in on that bitch-ass Becky, that soft-ass Becky that benefited off of my ancestors' blood, sweat, and fucking tears. No reparations still on the table. The reason I'm going in on this bitch, Laura Ingram, is because she dissed the fuck out of LeBron and KD. And this is a motherfucking disclaimer. I'm standing up for LeBron James and Kevin Durant as black men. Not basketball players, but black men. Alright? This is the time that we gotta start standing the fuck up for our own. I mean, this, this fucking racism, this racism shit is going rampant. And, and funny thing is, I used to be one of these colorblind niggas, you know what I'm saying? They speak all that uh, racism, they dead boy. I used to do that, but not no more. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell this bitch, Laura Ingham, something. Tell all them politicians that you love running with, run them fucking reparations. That's the only, you want, you want us to vote for your fucking candidates and all this other bullshit? Run them fucking reparations, bitch. Because your ancestors owe us a lot of motherfucking favors. Oh yeah, and I just did research on it. No, we don't lead the fucking nation in welfare. We don't lead the fucking nation in crime. I don't want to hear all this black on black crime bullshit after a fucking racist just shot up a Florida, another Florida school. And then we had, um, you know, in many times in history, a fucking uh, racist shot up uh, Sandy Hook. They shot up Colorado. You know what I'm saying? All these fucking mass shootings start with these racist ass uh, motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Yo people, Lord Ingram. Yo people. Yo people starting all these damn mass shootings. Do not talk to me about Chicago. Do not talk to me about Detroit and Baltimore and all this other fucking bullshit. Do not, don't, do not do that. When it's your people starting all these mass shootings and all this bullshit, but yet you want to call him a liberal? No, you motherfuckers are the same. Conservative, liberal, whatever. For you to tell KD and LeBron James to just stick to basketball, no, bitch, you get on your fucking knees and suck Ronald Reagan's dick. Because that's what you're doing right now. Go there and Sean Hannity. Yeah, yeah, wife and all that shit. You go crawl your ass over there, get on your fucking knees and suck a dick, bitch. That's what the fuck you need to do. Mad, mad at LeBron and um, KD because they don't uh, bow down to your uh, god of a president. Is that what you mad at, Laura Ingram, you bitch? Like, real talk. And it's, it, it's funny, the, the, and the fucked up thing is, Morio type is going after, you know, the homies. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm not going to even speak on that, but... Y'all are dying off. Of course, the corporate media will not uh, show it and all that shit, but y'all know y'all dying off. You know what I'm saying? So stop the bullshit talking about, oh, LeBron and KD, oh, they just dribble basketballs. No, bitch, they got a brain, too. And I hope they rape the fuck out of corporate America. Since we ain't got our reparations, we gonna rape the fuck out of corporate America. And I encourage every single brother and sister to start raping corporate America as well. Since they not gonna give us reparations, we should rape every damn, uh, we should rape every damn path to riches. You know what I'm saying? To get our shit back. I mean, every fucking thing was stolen from us. Everything, our culture, our language, everything was fucking stolen from us. But yet this bitch, Laura Ingram, want to go in and say, tell us to shut up and dribble. No, bitch. You go over there to Sean Handy's desk and suck a dick on your fucking knees, bitch. That's what you do. fucking amazing, man. These, these, fucking, these fucking racist people coming out the woodworks because their god of a president is in office. My gosh, man.
I mean, have you fucking racists have no shame? Oh, yeah, but you bitches are coming out the closet. Every white teacher should be out of black schools. Every uh, every single one of them. Because I, I, I work in one. I know where they are. I know how they act. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It's like, I just don't fucking understand it. I mean, um, a school in New York, I want to sit here, um, put her fucking foot on a black child's back. That should have been outrage. But since uh, if, I, if I lived in New York, that teacher would have got her ass whooped. Real talk. But with all these fucking laws saying that we can't put our hands on women and shit, you know what I'm saying? I don't want I don't want to go to jail with fucking domestic abuse and shit. But real talk, if I was a black woman and I saw a white teacher put her foot on my black child, she would have got her ass the toe up. Real talk. So the Lord Ingram and all these other motherfuckers that want to tell LeBron and KD to um. Shut up and dribble. No, bitch. You crawl over there to Sean Handy's desk and suck his dick. Straight up. Keep your mouth on the dick, bitch. Stay your ass out of our fucking affairs. And no, this ain't no liberal conservative argument. This is straight up racism. And I have every damn right to speak up on racism. Fuck you and your feelings and fuck every... Fuck everybody that want to salvage a god of a president that don't agree with this as well. This your motherfucking boy, 313 Hitman, speaking on some real shit for once. DVE bitch and I am gone.